Shockingly, this is not the only similarity between the Oklahoma suspects and the cultists in Waco. I mentioned it earlier, but the probable cause affidavits show that, every, actually, it's the arrest affidavits, they show that everybody now in custody belongs to a religious slash anti-government group called God's Misfits. I had not heard of them before, so we did a little digging, and I want to bring in Miranda Ijoldi. Um, she lives in uh, Veronica and Jillian's hometown of Hugoton, Kansas, and she knows the two women and their families personally. Um, Miranda, thank you so much, and I, my condolences go out to you and everyone who knew Veronica and Jillian. This has got to be such an incredibly difficult time. I wanted to get your reaction to the arrests that these particular four people were brought into custody? I think the, the, the main reaction was relief. Um, we were relieved to finally have a resolve on the situation. But surprise that the people in particular who were arrested, did you, did you think that four people would be arrested despite the fact the rumors that the grandma had such a cantankerous relationship not only with her ex-daughter-in-law, they weren't really married, but, you know, common-law daughter-in-law. Um, and many mm -hmm. in, the, in the town said she was very, very, um, she was scary. She was, that's how they referred to her. They said she was scary. Yeah. Um, I, I wasn't personally surprised about the number of people that they arrested. Um, I didn't know who the other players were going to be, but I think um, I, along with, a large number of people in the area um, realized that it was going to be Tiffany and and Pad, but um, I'm not surprised that there were more people that were part of it because it was impossible to pull that off in the window that they had in the broad daylight um, by themselves. There was no way they could have done it by themselves. Do you know this name, Paul Grice? Is there any talk around town of who this fifth person is who's mentioned as part of the conspiracy but not in the arrest lineup? Um, we, we have heard rumblings that there's a fifth person. I, until you just said the name, I had not heard the name yet. No. And then what about the Twombly's? What did you know about, um, about Cole and Cora Twombly? Anything? Um, I would say that I know that they are extremely right wing, um, that they have anarchist vibes. I mean, they, they feel like, and they talk like anarchists, definitely anti-government, um, definitely pro God, pro Christ, but I wouldn't call them Christians. And what about this group, God's Misfits? Um, it's, it was new to me, but I'm, you know, I don't spend a lot of time in that very remote part of the Oklahoma panhandle. So do you know about God's Misfits? Had you heard about this group before? Is it big? Is it just these people? Um, I don't think it's just those people, but I had never heard it have a name. Uh, there was no name for it. It was just a group of people. Um, and I think I would liken them to, uh, feeling like they had God's divine power, um, blessed to them. These are words that they've used. Um, but also feeling like the government was here to steal that from them and use, uh, whatever force they had to intervene with their rights and their will, their God-given rights. Last question. Do you know anything about this teenage daughter of uh, Cora Twombly, the 16-year-old who obviously we're not mentioning because she's a minor. Um, she's only listed by initials in the arrest affidavits. But she sure did give up the goods on all four of them, and in particular her own mother, and I think you know, Cole would be her stepfather. Do you know anything about her? No, I don't. Had you heard I, anything about her? 
I had only heard like rumblings and stuff that people had posted online, which I don't tend to trust. Um, what other people I would consider it a rumor or something like that. So no, I I hadn't heard anything other than rumors about uh, her playing in the situation. So, do you do you expect Miranda there'll be more arrests? Yes, I do think there will be more arrests. You do? Yeah, I do. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.